Well, friends of YouTube, you are now going to see all of my flyback transformers. Um, there's only four which are downstairs which are in oil. So I can't show you those because they're in oil and I didn't really want to bring them upstairs. So, all in all, I have around about, if I counted correctly, I have 48 flybacks. And I've got two more TVs, hopefully coming sometime next week. So that'll make 50 flybacks. <laughs> so, I wanted to share these flybacks with you and show you my wonderful collection. As I am a bit of a flyback freak, <laughs> as my wife says. She thinks I've got problems. Obviously, I must. So, let's get a nice closer view and I'll show you them all. I don't know why I like them so much, I just like the design, the way they look. I do like the way they look. I mean, in a minute I'll show you what I mean. This is an interesting looking one, isn't it? Yep. You'll see some of them, only a couple, there's only around about six I think which are, have been cut across the top there where I've got them from the scrapyard, it's, it's these drunkards and to find stuff and wait into whatever they can get for it and just cut it off. I can still use that, if I can repair that no problem. That's my big ones. This was one which was cut off. This is a Sony one out of a 26 inch TV. And somebody cut the cross. And what I've done there is, as you can see, I hot glued the crap out of it and stuck a connector on it. This wire connector, terminal connector. So I can just add a piece of high voltage wire to it. So yeah. This is one of those ones. And a little bit of a dif different design, but it's virtually the same as one of those big ones. I uh, dropped it unfortunately and broke the ferrite on it, but ferrite off some other ones still fits it, so I'm still able to use it. But this one is, I think the most I've whacked through this is 36 volts, which got quite warm and the case started cracking. I was using it for quite a while, so I had to remove it all. The strange thing is as well, when um, I removed the actual housing of this, the plastic, there was an oil resin, which is on the inside, underneath the skin of the plastic. Very strange. So, anyway, I'll explain to you why I like the look of these. It's just, I like the way they stand. You know, because the high voltage comes out the top. I, th I think they look really cool the way they stand. It's just something about them, I don't know what it is. Um, I'm hoping I'm not the only one who, who's a flyback freak. I'm hoping that somebody out there is feels the same way of, as me. <laughs> but it's quite remarkable as well, isn't it, how clean I get them. I mean, this one, I got this one today. Um, I got that one a couple of days ago. Um, which is a uh, out of a Sony uh, 28 inch, and this one's out of a 28 inch as well. Sony 28 inch, but different model. Um, and these were absolutely covered in that tar dust stuff, you know, as it is. Um, and it's amazing what a bit of bleach and the old fairy liquid in this in the sink can do. So. There you go guys, my immense collection of flybacks, pretty cool eh, look after yourselves, be safe and I'll speak to you again.